Right, morning guys. I hope you're well and had a good weekend. Just a bit of an update of what's going on here. Um, we had a really busy week last week. We had a little bit of footage that we unfortunately lost off the camera. Um, but we're going to try and do our best to put together what we've got to put this video out. Um, I'm going to walk you into the workshop as ever. There's Ronnie. Morning, Ronnie. Show you what's going on. Duncan. Hello. Uh, Dave, William. Right, so we're currently working on the doors for the Escort um, that we've now actually got in 2K high build primer. Um, there you go, so we're working on them at the moment. We've been doing quite a bit on the little RS Turbo to wait for its interior to come back. Um, we've just got the decals to put on it and a few bits and pieces, uh, the grill to go in. So. That's nearly there. The big thing is waiting for the trim to come back. Um, we've got the carpet back in, it's dynamat back in there, so that's uh, coming together. The e type jack turned up that we spoke about. It's going to have a, a, a full bare metal paint, and we're going to do the engine compartment as well. So, a lot of stripping out of all the bits and pieces in there um, to get that looking nice. So, that's a job for next year at the moment. Um, let me just take you back into the boat, show you what's going on in here. So the little blue Mark 1 S we're working on. Um, we've got the quarter panel welded on, the back panel welded on, um, the inner tub done. So now it's in the booth, masked up, all ready to go in our Noval for classic car epoxy primer. There you go. Looking nice and straight and all gapped up. So we're going to mix up some of our epoxy, get a couple of coats on that on there. We'll set the camera up and uh, show you how it goes. Right, so before we actually mix the epoxy and get it on the Mark 1 Escort, we're going to roll some footage um, that we've got of actually welding the quarter panel on. Um, we painted the inner tub and all the back of the panels for it went together. So we're going to roll that now. When that's finished, we'll get in the booth, get some epoxy laid down on the Escort. So we've got a bit of epoxy on this now. Yeah. So yeah, that's good. It's all good. We get a bit of colour on it. Right. So that's the inner tub painted, as you can see. Um, yeah, just a coat of paint on that. So that when we put the quarter panel on, it's fully painted behind there. Just stop the weather ever getting at it. So, yeah, on to the next stage. lost was of us painting the Mazda RX-7. We've got a walk round of it once we'd finished it outside the workshop so we'll put a little uh, montage together, all in bits and pieces, roll in there. When that's done we'll get some classic car epoxy on the little Mark 1. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh. You 
see the drip, yeah, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. You see the drip, yeah, I'm fitted up. Fit it up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all in your eardrums. I ain't never scared like bone crush. Boy, I got God, don't fear none. My line busy, take no calls. Feels like I don't have no flaws. So let's go and get the second one. Um, so we're just cleaning the gun out now the reason that we put the epoxy on the bare steel um, is just to add that anti-corrosive layer so rather than just putting filler on our bare steel which can actually suck the moisture in and then it's obviously sitting against the bare steel um, that's where the rust will start forming now we put this waterproof layer on being the epoxy primer now we'll work that is our foundation so we'll work off of that with our filler you know this car is not going to need polyester spray filler so we'll go straight from our filler work into our high build uh, four to one acrylic primer we'll get all that prepped up and then get it ready for paint so that's really the idea of the epoxy um, like I say just that waterproof barrier um, on the bare steel Right, so I've had a good day's progress on the Escort. A um, little bit of filler work here and there, just on all the joins where the quarter's gone on it. Um, still got to uh, put this seam in across here, but as you can see, all the gaps looking lovely. We've put some new door hinge pins on this side, because uh, the door just dropped a little bit, but new pins in it now, so that's, that's uh, shutting really nice, gaps bang on. As you can see all the boot gaps looking just perfect.
So we're going to get this into some high build primer tomorrow. Um, then we'll be shutting down for the week over Christmas. We'll get back in in between Christmas and New Year, get it prepped up, get some paint on it. So yeah, not long and this will be done and back to the customer. Right guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Uh, bell notification as well, then you'll see all our up and coming content, especially through the new year. Um, and on that note, I hope you all have an amazing Christmas and we'll see you soon.